<laughs> Welcome to the 31 Nights of Magoween! Every day in the month of October, I will review one spooky, scary movie! Come and join if you dare! <laughs> Who would have guessed that the direct sequel to an original film would manage to be just as good as the original film? Crazy. 2018's Halloween is a very well done film. When this came out, I was very skeptical about it. I didn't think it was going to be good, but after watching it in theaters and giving it a rewatch at home, I enjoyed this film a lot. At its core, it's a soft reboot slash legacy sequel to the original 78 film, and that works fine for me. One of the big selling points about this film is that the fact that Jamie Lee Curtis was coming back to face off against Michael Myers. And I will say, Jamie Lee Curtis is awesome in this film. Seeing her back as a PTSD survivor who was haunted by what happened to her that fateful Halloween is very interesting. I love horror movies don't show the aftermath of the surviving victim's lives after the event of the film. And this is a very interesting way to show trauma in the horror genre. Another aspect of the film I want to talk about is the story. Now, while it had its moments of being very, very dumb, for the most part, I was very invested into the story. The fact that they decided to make this a direct sequel to the OG film and completely disregard the events of the other films was a very bold strategy. But luckily, but luckily it worked out in the grand scheme of things. I say the one aspect of the film that I didn't care for would be the supporting characters. Well, to give it credit, not all of them were bad, just some of them didn't feel like fleshed out characters, especially their version of Dr. Loomis. This man annoyed the hell out of me with his assumption to hear Michael Myers talk like Goo Goo Gaga, first baby's word. Like, dude, at least Loomis wanted to kill this man. All he wanted to do is hear his first word. Come on. Halloween was released on October 19th, 2018 on a budget ranging between 10 to $15 million. After joining the box office, it on to gross $255.6 million worldwide. Overall, Halloween is a good sequel and a good introduction for the new generation of fans. It has enough to appease both old and new fans of the franchise. I'm going to give Halloween 2018 a 7.9 out of 10. Stay tuned for Night 20.